All right, what's up guys and girls? It's your boy Morty. I know it's been a long time coming, but I am back and I'm trying to make some more videos for y'all guys. I'm trying to be more consistent and get some more content pumping out. But uh, today we're gonna be learning how to get some nice high-end crisp vocals. This is a technique that I learned from another YouTuber. Uh, he did it on Pro Tools, but I'm doing it on FL Studios. So uh, it's not a complete rip off of that. But yeah, this will be a free preset for y'all, for all my subscribers. I'll give this to y'all for free so y'all can get some nice high-end vocals. Before we get started, uh, make sure you check out my links in the description box below. I have my, my vocal presets, my store that has all the vocal presets that I use on these videos. So y'all can purchase some of that, help out the channel. I also have my DistroKid link if you want to go ahead and put your music out there. I have my SoundCloud if you want to check that out. And also I have my equipment links um, for my microphone, my uh, interface, and all that type of stuff. So yeah, if you want to support the channel, there it is. Let's get started. All right, guys, so make sure you have headphones on so you can hear the crispness of the vocals, the crispy vocals. Uh, it might show up on like speakers or something like that. But yeah, let's go ahead and just jump into the tutorial. Uh, so here's how the vocals sounds without the effect on. I said, I don't have no science to be sad. <laughs> I got all my things in my bag. All right, so yeah, you can tell the vocal is not too bright. But yeah, so this is how we do it. So, so basically what you got to do is route your uh, vocals to another insert. So here's our main vocals. We're going to route this by clicking, right clicking and uh, doing sidechain to this track. So now it's going to sidechain all this audio to this uh, blank insert. We're going to name this insert high end vocal vocals and uh, we'll make the color like blue or something. And then unroute it from the master track and route it to your bus or whatever. You can leave it to your master track. It just depends what you're doing. Uh, I'll, I'll put it on a vocal bus and I do route this track. So that's it for that. Now the first thing you want to have on this uh, on uh, the effect wise. So we're gonna be using a parametric EQ and we're gonna go to order steep eight type high pass and then we're gonna just move it and cut off everything that we don't want which is all the mids and uh, lows. We're gonna cut it like around uh, 8,000 or 9,000. And then we're gonna boost up uh, the vocals to about 12, uh, 12 decibels. Next thing we do is we compress this vocal. So we're gonna like squish the vocal. We're not, we're not gonna squish it, we're just gonna control the peaks. So it sounds even. And then we're just push it like four, four, three ratio. And next thing we're gonna do is add a Maximus. This is gonna be our de -esser. So, you know, there's like a lot of S's and all that that pierce our ears. So we wanna get rid of that. So we gotta go to presets and go to de -essing. either narrow band or split. I think it's narrow, yeah. And then uh, we're just gonna make it a little bit over here and then just push it down. So this is uh, the compressor acting like on this certain frequency and it's pushing down these vocals. Uh, last thing I'm gonna add is a limiter. And you want to just have it sit on top of the vocal. I said, I don't have no science of it. And just push it up a little bit. I said, I don't have no So now the vocal is a thick vocal. So yeah, you can already hear how the vocal sounds with that high end on it. But, uh, you know, you just mix it until it sounds good to you and to where it's not overbearing. So so like this, you push it down, the volume all the way down. Play uh, the vocal. I said, I don't have no science. And then just push up the fader. I said, I don't have no science of it. Sad. <laughs> I got all my things in my bag. Huh. Running through As you push it up, it sounds more uh, high-end, crisp uh, effect that you want. But if you don't want to do all that, uh, make sure you subscribe because I'll be giving this preset for free. And uh, yeah, you just throw the insert on the vocal like this. Here's my uh, secret sauce for high-end vocals. I, that's my preset that I made. And yeah. I said, I don't have no science to be sad. <laughs> I got all my things in my back. So you don't have to do anything I just showed you. Just download the preset that I have. Uh, yeah, just email me if you want the preset. And make sure you subscribe. And I'll give it to you. And it's for free. So yeah, that was a quick um, way on how to get high in vocals. And this is how it sounds with everything on. I said, I don't have no science to be That's how it sounds. Uh, I'm, I'm, I was all over the place with this uh, effect or tutorial. Sorry about that, guys. But yeah, just email me if you want the preset. It's free. And yeah, that's how you get high in vocals or that high, clean, high, clean, crisp, whatever. But yeah, uh, if you want to see more content like this, please subscribe. Uh, comment down below what you want to see next time. Um, yeah, make sure you come back and check, check out what I have. And uh, yeah, join the family. Peace. I was uh, back then.
what you want from me. Diamonds ain't quite what you want.